Nothing like getting shot in the first 15 minutes. screen. All right. Yeah, we're going to run into those. I suppose I could talk about something. I had Taco Bell for dinner. <laughs> it was good, too. Oh, there we go. Well, you're alive. So it would seem. So how do you feel? I don't know the polite word for it. I do. Stupid is the word we use around here. What were you doing? <laughs> I was... Oh, I was doing something stupid. Well, you'll be okay. Once you didn't die, the doctor said you'd be fine. He got the bullets out a couple days ago. Good. It cost us $15. I'm sorry, madam. Should have left me there to die. Did you want to die? I mean, was that it? Was that why you went straight out to Fort Mercer and picked a fight with the worst bandit in the county? To die, Mr. Er, Mr. Uh, Marston. John Marston. Bonnie McFarland. Miss Bonnie McFarland. Well, you may be right, Miss McFarland. I don't know. Huh. So what were you doing? I was trying to give Mr. Williamson a chance. For old time's sake. You know Bill Williamson? I knew him long time ago. Well, what was he like? Dumb. Just like you. <laughs> Thank you, miss. <laughs> See my hat? I have. I need my hat. And, uh, what will you do now? Now I'm gonna take my time and go after him the less kind way. Well, that sounds very fun, Mr. Marston. Quite heroic. Just like in those penny dreadfuls my brother used to read. Meanwhile, if you'll excuse me, I've got a ranch to run. Of course, if you're feeling better, why not take a ride with me later and help me patrol the perimeter? You can earn back some of that money we wasted on doctor's bills. Of course. And thank you for saving my life, I mean. Next time, Mr. Marston, I strongly recommend you don't try to lose it quite so earnestly. I'll bear that in mind. Oh, yeah. We like getting shot at, though. What fun would it be if we didn't? All right. Once again, I have control of John, who will be hurt for a little while. If you stop, he'll hold his side, I think. Or, yeah, maybe it's just that one time. Okay. We're going to go find Bonnie. Yeah, it's a pretty big ranch. Let's just run straight to the yellow... What am I, colorblind, dumbass, blue circle? Mr. Marston, back in the land of the living, I see. Figured it's about time I started paying back that $15. I sure can use an extra pair of hands around here. Let's see if we can get you back in the saddle. Yeah, he does hold his side if he stands still for too long. He does recover from that gunshot remarkably quickly, though, by the way. Kind of like Nathan Drake did in Uncharted 2. There's the foreman's <laughs> office. It's also where we lock up good-for-nothing outlaws, such as yourself. I'm happy enough with <laughs> my current quarters right now, Miss McFarland. Okay, let's yeah. see if you can still ride a horse. Let's make a tour of the ranch so you can get your bearing. Come on. Okay, I can handle that. Okay, everybody, meet Bob. Bob is the name of my horse. Whether it be this horse or any other horse, my horse shall be known as Bob. To your 
Bob, is, the Bob is my buddy. You won't find Parisian high fashion, but it's good for the essentials. Very convenient. I don't think I've ever seen a ranch with its own store before. Another thing is cool is while you're looking at something, if you're holding or you're following the a horse. This one's oh, for the horses. What do you think? I'm no expert, but it certainly looks like a fine corral. I suspect you've stolen more horses than you've broken. Now where'd you get such an idea? First impressions are hard to erase. <laughs> She's got a point. But yeah, well, looking at something, your That's horse will stay on the station. road, which is cool. Things sure have changed since the line finally got finished. Bringing in all sorts of new folk like yourself. Is that such a bad thing? Change is only good when it makes things better. That's the barn over there. Paul built it himself when I was just a little girl. Back at the house. Let's stop for a while before we head out on patrol. You'll get no complaints from me, Miss McFarland. <coughs> yep, we gotta hitch Bob up. Come on, this Otherwise he tends to wander. I like to run a lot, too. How about a cold drink, Mr. Marston? Thank you, ma'am. Getting shot, then riding a horse seems to take it out of you. <laughs> I could use a rest. Sure. Come on in. I'll show you the house, and then you can sit for a while. Thank you. Mr. Marston. Miss McFarland. Remember me telling you about the trouble we've been having with rustlers and other undesirables? I do. Will you help me keep watch on the property line this evening? Sure. I want to see just who is trespassing on our land. This is a fine weapon. Come, let's head out. The country is really beautiful at around this time. Yeah, we definitely want to help Bonnie. She keeps giving We're us shit. Get moving. <laughs> this is a dangerous time of night for us. <clears throat> John's got a repeater now. That's good. Come on, Bob. Let's go. Keep your eyes open and try not to get yourself shot again. <laughs> right? Thank you, Mr. Marston. I feel a lot happier someone's along with me. I feel a lot happier now I got a rifle. Well, with your trigger itch and my <laughs> feminine intuition, we should make quite a team. <coughs> yeah, it's night. Let's look at the sky. Ooh, I don't believe cool. it. Those damn rabbits are back. Give me a hand with them, will you? Hold up here, Bob. Come on, then. Time to put that bloodlust of yours to good use. Get rid of the rabbits. Okay. L2 will draw. Fighter. <laughs> okay. Let's get going. We've still got plenty of ground to cover. Yeah, um, quickly pressing L2 will cause. Stealing our cattle, it's the rabbit stealing our crops. It ain't never easy living off the land like this. Maybe you should move to a big city, become a lady of leisure. Was that a coyote? Get those pets before they scare the livestock. Ah, dead eye. This thing is great. My shit. Okay, slow down. 
pretty much it lets you slow down time and pick your shots. For the most part, what's really happening is John is just shooting so quickly that to the, to the bystander, it looks like he's firing in a, in a quick blink of an eye. I don't know. That's the only sense I could make of it. Actually handle a rifle. It's something I've had a little experience in. Maybe Bill Williamson did get lucky after all. Luck didn't really come into it, miss. You're a useful man to have around the ranch, that's for sure. But don't think I've forgotten what brought you here. We'll do whatever we can to help you. I sure appreciate that, Miss McFarland. Mr. Marston. Thank you for your help, Mr. Marston. Makes me kind of happy I saved your life. Get some sleep and I will see you in the morning. Good night, Miss McFarlane. Alright, yeah, that's another cool thing is if I get separated from Bob, he'll automatically return to like the hitching post by my nearest house. Later I'll be able to call him, which is kinda cool too. Yeah, I get some ammo out of here. I mean, yeah, I was talking about uh, pulling your gun. A quick L2 press will automatically target the nearest enemy to John if he's looking at one. Like right away, say there was an enemy where that lamp is, you know, he'd, he'd just lock onto it right away. And then you can quickly shoot or whatever. And then there's Deadeye, which, yeah, I kind of talked about. It's pretty badass. The Deadeye gauge is on the right side, it's the red one. While I'm in it, it depletes. You can see it's depleting now. And I can shoot while in it, or you know, turn it off at will with R3, and it it regenerates over time, or when I make certain kills. But anyway, I am going to make a save, and I'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> 